What's up guys, it's iDevice Forever here and in this video I'm here to show you guys how to get movie box on your iPhone, iPod or iPad which is running iOS 9. Right, so I'm just going to show you guys that I'm running iOS 9 at the moment, so... Right, there we go, so we have it as a version 9.0. Right, so anyway, so let's jump right in. So, uh, so in order to install movie box on your, uh, on your iDevice, you need vShare on your phone, alright? So, I made a video right yesterday that how to install vShare on your phone. It's a little different on iOS 9, so, so I'm just going to show you briefly on what to do. So, so right here, you just got to go ahead to download, if you're unjailbroken, you just want to hit it over here. And if you're jailbroken, you just want to hit on this one. So, I'm unjailbroken. I've already installed it. So, once you're done uh, downloading vShare, you won't be able to in the, you know open it up. So for that, you need to go ahead to settings and to general and to all the way down to profile. Right. So you have this enterprise app right here. You just want to go ahead, hit on that, and it's probably going to show up for you guys who are new to vShare, who have just installed it. It's going to be it showed up as a trust app. You just want to hit on that, and then you'll be able to open up vShare. Right, so once you're done, uh, you know, once you open up vShare, and in case you guys didn't understand what to do, I'll leave a link in the description down below to show you guys how to install vShare and stuff. Right, so once you're here, you just want to go ahead to the search bar. Right here, you have movie box, you just want to go ahead and tap on that, and here's all info about it. You just want to go ahead, uh, you just want to go ahead, hit on download right here. Right, it must be downloading now. And yes, it is. I'll be back once this is done. Alright, so it's done downloading. It should be installing in a moment now. Wait for it to load. Alright, it's probably... This should be asking a question to install or not. Alright, there we go. So we're just going to hit on install. Go all the way back. And it should be installing now. And we are go. Alright, so now once you have movie bug installed, you just want to go ahead and open it up. Right, so we have movie box right here. Alright, so processing. I really don't know why uh it takes it took a long time for me to open uh, it never actually open, you know, close the window, so I had to close it manually. Alright, so you just want to go ahead and close it manually and uh, choose on any movie right now, for example, straight out of Compton. Right, so uh, for most of you, or uh, you know, this may be going to be showing up, video not available. Um, right, so this is because uh, the content is actually blocked, um, the content of movie box is blocked in your country. So for the people maybe living in the US, it's probably going to work. And for you, the guys who are not living in the US, is, you know, maybe this is going to show up. Alright, so for the people uh, who are fine with it, it's probably going to be showing the, you know, the resolution of the movie 360p, 480p, and uh, 1080p as well. So uh, 720p, I guess. Anyway, so you just want to choose on one of that and play it. For the people who have this being shown up, this form me, right? So you just want to go ahead and hit on buy. They're gonna show you of all the stuff, right? So the, you probably you just need a VPN in order to run it. Uh, that's we, what we all do, all right? So uh, you just want to go ahead to this website right here, and they're gonna tell you about all this stuff. Right, for the iPad users, you have to do something like this. I'll leave a link in the description down below that'll take you to this place. And uh, for the people who are running it, uh, who are using it on the iPhone, I'll be showing you guys what exactly to do. I'll leave a link in the description uh, down below to this website as well. Right, so with, for the people who are using iPhone at the moment, so you just want to go ahead to settings, go, the, go back to VPN. Right, so here we are VPN. You want to add a VPN configuration. You want to make sure the type is PPTP right here. And now go back and description. It really doesn't matter. You just want to go ahead and add anything. I'll just add VPN. Right, server. Uh, you you just want to make sure you add in US dot. Uh, this is really important, so make sure you follow me. Uh, just free VPN dot com. Oh, God damn it. It really isn't easy tapping at the single hand, right? So yeah, US dot uh, just free VPN dot com, and you can either uh, you can also change this to US, uh, or you can either change it to CA or uh, I guess UK as well, right? So CA for the Canada and UK is for United Kingdom, right? So once you're done with that, you just want to go ahead uh, to just free VPN, 
just free VPN. Right, this is difficult. Just free VPN, okay? And you want to leave the RSA secure ID, just leave it right there as it is, alright? So, and password, uh, it's going to be 2572 for this one. So, 2572 it is. Alright, so this is only for US and for the uh, in case you're going to be using some other server uh, that you, that is you have to leave I'll be leaving the link in the description down below to that website that is just freevpn.com. You just probably want to you know go ahead to check their site out and they they'll be giving you that password for the other servers as well in case US doesn't work out. Right, so and then you want to make sure the encryption level is auto and send all traffic is uh, selected as well. Right, so now you want to go ahead to done and save it. Right, so we have it right there. You want to go back and uh, make sure movie box is closed at the moment. We have movie box closed anyway. So uh, now we go back to settings and uh, we switch on our VPN. Wait for it to load. Probably take a moment, I guess. Okay, I'll get back to you guys once this is done uh, connecting. Alright, so our VPN is now connected. Now you want to go ahead to Movie Box. Right, so make sure you had closed it previously. Alright, so now open up Movie Box once again. It's loading up. Okay. Processing. Alright, so you just want to close it or anything like that. Alright, so just got to go close it. Straight out of Compton again, and you see that it's loading. You have an ad right here. Oh my god, what is this? Right, so yeah, now you get to see that it's 360p. You have the resolution right there, and you just gotta choose on one of them 480p or 720p, and then you have the watch. You can just watch it right now, alright? So I don't wanna hit on that because I don't have, you know, I don't want my video to get flagged or something. Anyway, thanks for watching, and you know, you're already done. You're already halfway done. You just gotta hit on resolution and watch it. Right guys, I hope this helped you guys out and if it did, make sure you give me a thumbs up and also subscribe for more iDevice related content. And in case you guys have uh, updated to iOS 9 and you guys want to know how to get paid apps, I have another video uh, which shows you guys how to get paid apps for free. Right so guys, thanks for watching, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.